hello everybody welcome back to my channel so in today's vlog we are going to be working on a custom design and I'm seriously obsessed with this isn't this color gorgeous I mean I'm so obsessed with this color champagne gold oh my goodness it's stunning so I'm basically working on a custom design for a customer of mine a client of mine and she's going to be accepting a prestigious award so we got to get her right you know it's the beginning of the year it's award season and I'm so excited that she came to me to create this design for her she's mostly a person who wears only black and she decided to step out of the box this year for something new so I'm going to be working on this today and it's going to be amazing. I wanted to mention that in the beginning of this year, I, mem I remember telling you guys in the first vlog that I'm going to be focusing on sequins. And because it's something that I was doing last year that I noticed that I really, really love doing. And so this year I wanted to basically um, double down on it because I'm like, I need to be standing for something that I like to do and want to do. And because I made that decision, everything that... I wanted started gravitating towards that decision so when you stand on your convictions you stand on business as they say um, you start seeing all the things that you are wanting gravitate towards it because that is what you're saying that you want anything that you say that you want and you don't follow through says cause confusion in your inner world in your universe um, the desires that God has given you, um, you're saying that, well, if you say you want this, why is it that you're not standing on that conviction? Instead, you're going against it. And therefore, since you're going against it, you're saying that this is what you want. So we as designers or people in general, if we want something and we believe that we are deserving of this thing that we want, we have to remain firm about these things that we want and desire in our hearts so that way we can get it no matter how long it takes and what the circumstances are if you are a hundred percent sure about what is it that you want it should come to fruition so I'm really focusing my attention on that uh, this year so that way I can get the things that I desire and believe and keep the belief in in them knowing that they are going to come towards me so this year like i said is going to be amazing because i said so and we are going to see the outcome of this year okay been a couple of days and the jumpsuit is finally complete I mean it's gorgeous so all I have to do is add some hook and eyes and that's about it do a little bit more pressing and steaming and it's ready to ship so
right guys so i finished steaming it sat here for a little bit just to make sure everything is dropped when it comes to stretch fabric so that way it doesn't have any issues and now i'm going to go ahead and start packing what is that so i have these gold boxes and i'm ready to upgrade not upgrade but you know kind of like spruce up my packaging because i want it to be a little bit upscale you know um but i like to keep it very like personal because i think it's like right now since i'm in my in my early days of my brand you know when you get that moment where the brand before the brand becomes well known and you're able to you know scale to the you know industry type of packaging I think the early days is where the creativity comes in and I think people appreciate that the most. So as creative as your package can be, this will be the best time to like showcase your creativity and how you, um, you know, uh, appreciate your customer for buying from you and what makes you unique. So right now I've got this gold one. I usually have silver boxes, but gold, silver ran out, so I have gold. And so I'm going to just use that and prepare it's i hope it can fit in here i don't know this might not fit all right we're gonna try let me get my wrapping paper let me just use this one i think uh, i'm trying to decide which gold detail i want to use they have these gold polka dot but i think that's too much this gold stripe mm, i'm gonna pass on that i think i'm gonna just use the specs i think the gold specs are just enough detail to kind of bring it up so let's go with that wrapping paper i'm gonna use the plain white in the box Quickly fold this up. Whoa, how do I fold this? So I'm gonna fold this. This is actually heavy. I didn't realize how heavy this is. carefully examining this box is too small so I'm gonna go ahead and bring this one because it's much bigger as you can see it's just plain white um, I'm gonna go ahead and try to make it pretty as possible I am going to be using the gold spec wrapping paper tissue paper Pretty. Let's put this in the middle. Right, 
this is as good as it's going to get. guys so I'm gonna be writing my thank you notes I'm so excited like I said this is like the first order of the year and I no, actually is the last order of last year but I'm shipping out this year because this person bought it at the brink of New Year's so that's like a, a start you know what I'm saying but um and I'm just thrilled because this is gonna be an amazing year like I said and I just feel so honored when someone purchases. it's just uh, it just it just excites me because you know the passion that goes into me crafting a design and someone appreciating the artwork and saying that I want this piece in my closet because it resonates with me I mean it just feels like no other especially when you see them wearing it you know my customers they tend to be very discreet when it comes to pieces but I know I know the girls are going to be buying in the future. They're going to be sharing it. And you guys going to see that when I do share. If they make it known in public. But other than that, I'm going to go ahead and write my thank you note. Because I got to get out of here and go ship. But um, if you are starting off, stay true to yourself. Okay? And know that someone is going to appreciate the art that you make. Okay? Okay? As long as you are making it with love, someone else is going to resonate with it and say, that's a piece that talks to me, it speaks to me, and I want that in my, in my life. I feel like this is the one for me. You made this for me. So, you know, just focus on doing things that you love that someone else can appreciate while helping, if you understand. So once you got all that in the mix, you got something of value. So.